there. He might be choosing it for the matchup. Immediately opting to go to Smashville, the handshakes, and we are off. I know False as the player is going to look to immediately establish stage control. That is one of his top priorities. There we go, the down throw into Marth Aerials. GOG doing a pretty good job of evading, but despite the space he's creating, he's not taking that opportunity to pull a banana, and that's one of the main advantages Diddy has, especially against Marth. False just rocking all over him. False also seeing that banana pull and immediately punishing him for it. And this is where False shines, the edge garden. It's going to be very hard for GOG to get back. There we go. Continuing the edge guard. The tipper back air is actually going to do it. Nathan a bit of suspect DI there, but let's see what happens next. Because False right now is already off to a commanding start. Oh, the jump forward air. Oh, there, the down smash actually going to punish False's uh, drop from ledge there. GOG getting a lot better momentum. I think he's been catching on to a bit of False's tricks. Side B going to punish that, immediately punishing the aerials there. Ooh. Just mispredicting where that side B is going to come out. GOG gets a free grab. Banana, he's definitely going to be looking. Oh, just waited a little bit too long on that. He, I think he read the neutral getup or the roll behind, but regardless, he wasn't quick enough. Wow, that's going to do it. So False ends up snuffing out any form of momentum that GOG ended up uh, creating in that last game. GOG opting to change characters here. I know he has a plethora, so a random. <laughs> I'd like to see that. Samus. False going Samus. Donkey Kong. And GOG opting accordingly to go to Donkey Kong. Interesting. I know Samus is a pretty good projectile in zoning game, so it may be hard for DK to get in for that grab. Three, two, one, go! GOG trying to charge that, but immediately going in, misfacing that back air punish there. The upbeat from False. Forward air is going to catch that tech in, uh, that get up in place. There's coming out. A <laughs> jab mixing that up right there. GOG opting to go for some form of ledge guard. The back air catching his air dodge. False. Oh, doesn't opt to go for a second up there, despite GOG DIing in. Got a second forward air. Let's see what's going on here. He's going to try. Oh, he was going for a shield break setup. Gets the immediate ding dong. Tries to get another grab. That down air actually auto canceling, making it pretty safe to do. Forward air coming out. Oh, edge guard not quite going to do it. GG air driving at just the right time. But now False is a full charge shot. Let's see what he can do with this. Yep, punishes that getup. If you are forced into a tech situation like that against Samus, 90% of the time she's just going to charge shot because that covers nearly every single option. Alright, False now in the air. GG trying to capitalize, but he lands safely. Up air to back air. Getting another fist string started with that dash attack. GOG is having a tough time landing. And when he does land, False is just interrupting everything that he wants to do with a simple jab or forward tilt or his air. There we go, the neutral air. Wow, that was very strong coming from False. Ending the game. False taking it 2 0. Oh, I might be called soon. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, that was a commanding game by False. Sorry guys, just getting some water. Throat's getting a little bit hoarse. Four minutes set. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> 